With Resident Evil 2, 3, and soon to be 4 all getting the remake treatment, what does that mean for Resident Evil going forward? That's the question that I ask myself a lot of the time when I'm making these videos, and I honestly wanted to dive into some thoughts and also some opinions that I wanted to talk about. As many of you are aware, Resident Evil 8 is the most current, up-to-date Resident Evil in the Resident Evil franchise, and I'm talking about uh, story and year, right? I mean, Resident Evil Village just got its first DLC also in October, and they're not going to be releasing any more for it and to top it all off they also have the multiplayer going on which is um for the most part pretty boring but this isn't going to be a video talking about my opinions on the games in current years those are just the games that have come out in the last couple of years regarding one of my favorite franchises and some others look resident evil getting the remake treatment is nothing wrong resident evil 2 is regarded and is one of my favorite games of all time and i didn't know too much about the resident evil franchise up till resident evil 2 and playing resident evil 4. this video is just going to be talking about what's going forward and what's going to be happening to the franchise and i'm going to be just talking about some opinions i have going into this video I think the entire fan base for the Resident Evil franchise is kind of divided. On one hand, people really do like the remakes, including myself. And I think personally, I don't think Resident Evil 5, which a lot of people suspect are going to be getting the remake treatment. Also, Resident Evil 6 will not be getting remade. And I think that's just because Resident Evil 5 and 6 were probably one of Capcom's most disappointing games and of course they sold well but I don't think they're going to be remaking it and changing complete layers of the gaming experience in them. I don't think they would want to touch up anything on that and I don't think they would want to waste the resources. To talk about other games in the Resident Evil franchise like Code Veronica, maybe that is a possibility. There are fan remakes that are currently out where people can enjoy the game in a different aspect made by the fans of the franchise keep that in mind but i don't think capcom is going to be making uh any effort to remake these games and it's quite sad i mean you know but there's going to be a time and place where capcom just puts their foot down and realizes yeah our time is done we're done remaking these games they're cult classics and fan favorites you know these games a lot of people grew up playing and bringing it to a new generation of gamers was the best decision they could have made you know, they're banking off nostalgia keep that in mind and with resident evil 4 coming out which is regarded as one of the greatest games of all time keep that in mind it influenced a generation of new games also guys to bring up resident evil 1 remake I don't think that they're going to be making another Resident Evil 1 remake, and I'm talking about the original. The original already has a remake, and that's on the GameCube, and if you look at the GameCube and the original, it's a night and day difference. They're two completely separate games. The other one has more content, the other one has less content. I'm well aware though, guys, obviously due to the time they were released at, the capabilities of the hardware that these games were released that were not the best and to bring Resident Evil 1 back into the limelight and Capcom obviously remake the game from the ground up again would just be a complete and stupid idea I mean the game's already there man I think what Capcom seeked to make back in the day with the remake of the original on GameCube keep in mind to get this game remade on GameCube I think they've already succeeded and to re-remake it again, I don't really think that would work out for them. And I don't think it would be a really good idea. But what's next, man? I mean, Resident Evil 9 is its going to be approaching soon, man. Maybe in the next couple of years. Maybe in the next year or two. I mean, I think Capcom is bringing back Resident Evil in a new fashion. I don't think the remakes are always going to be cutting it. I know Resident Evil 3 was a major disappointment, Resident Evil 2 succeeding it, and just Resident Evil 3 being the escape goat, but I don't know, man. Keep in mind, these games are 
very well made. But yeah, with Resident Evil 9 coming out in the next couple years, it's probably an early development at the latest. I mean, we know Capcom has other games that they're coming out with soon. I mean, Street Fighter. We haven't even heard anything about Pragmato. And then there's that dinosaur game or something that Capcom are developing. Uh, but other than that, guys, I don't know what's going to be happening soon, man. Because I love Resident Evil. But if they're just going to keep remaking the games that they currently have in their library, that's going to be a little uh, disappointing to me personally because I would love for them to flesh out the Resident Evil franchise or even at least reboot it, man. I think Resident Evil might need a reboot. I mean, they did that with Resident Evil 7, bringing Ethan and Mia and the Bakers into the franchise, you know, setting a new plot and different characters, you know, not with Chris, uh, freaking Jill or Leon, you know, but... It's, it's time, man. I mean, it's definitely time for a change soon. I don't think Resident Evil is going to always be remakes and remakes and remakes. But, yeah. Other than that, guys, if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to drop a like. Subscribe if you guys are new. And other than that, guys, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.